Well, good afternoon, everybody. Camila here. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are doing well. Today is Taco Tuesday, of course. Let me know what type of tacos you like. Street tacos, hard shell tacos, del taco, whatever tacos. Let me know what type of tacos you like. But anyway, um, once again, I hope you all are doing well. Um, uh, it's a beautiful day outside. Um, for, uh, the sun is out a little bit and so forth. But anyway, um, if you have not already subscribed to my channel, uh, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Uh, click that great notification bell that will alert you to any new videos that I post. And also, don't forget to thumbs up this video as well. So today's video is long overdue. Um, I did my first video on this um, maybe two years ago. So it's only right that I come back and do this video today um, because it's been a while since I done one and the first video that I did on this uh, got a lot of reviews or views um, so without further ado let's go ahead and get into this video and today's video is going to be a coffee creamer review yes I said it a coffee creamer review and I have quite a few creamers in here to review with you. Um, so let's go ahead and get into this um, video. Don't mind the back, don't mind the background sounds. That's the phone. I have the windows open to let in some fresh air. So anyway, let's go ahead and get into this video. So the first coffee creamer that I'm going to be discussing is from the brand. Um, it's from the brand. Coffee Mate, and this is the Cinnamon Toast Crunch Creamer. Um, I do believe you can still buy this creamer. You just have to check your, lo your local grocery store, um, such as if you're in the Inland Empire, check Stato Brothers, Winco, Food for Less, um, and Walmart and Target. But anyway, so this is the Coffee Mate Cinnamon Toast Crunch Creamer. And let me tell you, I was very impressed with this creamer. It tastes just like the cereal, um, but in coffee. So you got the best of both worlds. You have the cereal and the coffee all together. Um, so on a side note, um, you get the, you know, when you eat the, um, the cinnamon toast crunch and all the cinnamon is left in the milk, that's what you get in this creamer and it, it's, it's very good but um, would I repurchase it? No because there's so many other creamers out there on the market that I'm trying to um, check out and taste so uh, yeah but anyway this was a good creamer it tasted just like the cereal. The next coffee creamer is the Red Velvet Coffee Mate Creamer and I'm going to say you can probably only get this one during the holidays. And I do believe I got this one around um, Christmas. So, <laughs> yeah, that's how long I've been holding on to this bottle. But um, I didn't get too much red velvet out of this one. Um, not too much. I wasn't very impressed with it. Would I buy it again? Uh, no, because maybe they need to put a little bit more velvet in it like I don't know I just wasn't I didn't get the red velvet out of this and like I said this is during the holidays because it says on the back of it sips of the season so you'll only be able to get this one during the holidays so yeah I wasn't too much impressed with this coffee creamer the next coffee creamer is um sugar cookie sugar cookie and this is from international delight and this like i said frosted sugar cookie and i definitely got sugar cookie out of this creamer um once again this is a holiday creamer um because it says delight in the season as you can see here so this definitely tasted like sugar cookie um i will probably more than likely purchase this one again during the holidays because i really did get sugar cookie out of this creamer um the next creamer is 
French Toast Swirl. And this is another one by International Delight. And this was all of, also during the holiday season. But like I said, you may luck out and get some of these creamers in your local grocery store. I don't know. Um, I don't go to the grocery store that often. But um, I definitely got French Toast out of this creamer. I enjoyed it. And it is definitely, definitely a must repurchase during the holidays. Definitely love French, oh, my, my bad, it's called French Toast Swirl. And once again, it's by International Delight. Like I said, that's how long I've had these creamers. I've just been waiting for the right time to do a video on these creamers. Um, if you have not checked out my first video on my creamer reviews, I will go ahead and link it up some, link it here somewhere and I will, I will also link it down below in the description bar and you could probably also find the video at the end of this video as well now the next creamer is from coffee mate and this is by nestle nestle owns coffee mate and international delight is i'm trying to figure out who is this owned by danon proud member of the danon family i don't know but anyway, moving right along. So once again, this is from Coffee Mate, and this is the Fun Fetty Creamer, and this was good. This was definitely good. Um, you got some vanilla, you got some sprinkles in here. I was definitely impressed with this coffee creamer. Um, you didn't need a piece of cake because you got cake right here and a cup of coffee. So um, this was definitely a good buy um i do believe they still sell funfetti um just always always check your lo local grocery store walmart and target but i do believe this is permanent in the coffee mate um creamer section so go ahead and check for funfetti but very good co coffee creamer impress will repurchase it but like i said i'm trying out some new creamers that i will eventually do a video on and i can't wait to do a video on those creamers but anyway moving right along the last creamer is butterscotch latte and this is also a coffee mate creamer and i bought this in the small bottle um was not impressed with this one at all didn't get very much butterscotch in here um if I eat butterscotch, it's normally in a candy, like um, Werther's candy. Um, and then also I like butterscotch pudding. Um, definitely can taste it in the pudding, but I could not taste any butterscotch in this creamer at all. Was not impressed. Will not be repurchasing. Um, and also you can see the little butterscotch candies down here. The heart, I mean... To be truthfully honest with you, you can get you a hard butterscotch candy, drop it in your uh, coffee, let it melt, and just put some regular half and half in it, and you can, but I, like I said, I didn't catch any butterscotch in this creamer at all. Um, that was a quick video. Um, I want to thank you for watching. Um, I will definitely see you in the next video because I ain't got nothing but time to do videos but anyway once again if you have not seen my first coffee creamer review i will go ahead and list that down below in the description box and you can also catch it at the end of this video i hope you all have a beautiful week weekend um and don't forget to like subscribe and click the gray notification bell so you don't miss a video upload bye